World Cup W1 Anya Shrub Soul I am lost for words, if I am honest. Just an unbelievable game. We looked for a minute like we were out but the greatest thing about this team is we never give up. Hardly got that vital wicket of Harman Preet Kaur. It was just an amazing game from start to finish, a fitting final for what has been a brilliant World Cup. It's a World Cup final there's a huge amount of pressure. There's so much pressure on the new batters coming in. We never the run rate get away from us even though we weren't getting wickets. We knew if we got a couple we'll be right in the game. So all's well in the end. I think it is a dream, playing at Lords, and a dream you never think is going to come true. I've seen my dad play in the Cup National Knockout. Now to be here 16 years later as a World Cup winner is amazing. Heather Knight. I can't stop smiling at the moment. We've won those tight games which is something we've worked on in the last 18 months. We've worked on situations where the heat is on us and look to come up on top. They were batting brilliantly, credit to them, they've had a great tournament. But we knew that if we stayed on till the end and brought the rate up over 5 or 6, we would be in the game. A huge thank you to the crowds as well for coming up in large numbers and supporting up. Women's cricket keeps growing from strength to strength and all teams have shown that. The tournament has been outstanding, England is a perfect place to be hosting this tournament given the stage at which we are now. Alex Hartley. I cannot believe it. This is what we've been working for. The girls were absolutely fantastic, we got over the line and it is an absolute dream come true for all of us. Yes 100% about nerves of playing at Lords. I've never even stepped on the ground before, so it is absolutely fantastic we've managed to pull off this win. What a hero, on Anya Shrub Soul. Fran Wilson. A little bit nervous towards the end. The character of this team is such that, we knew we could pull through. We've done it before, we knew we could do it again. Credit to Anya, she's amazing. Everyone was amazing. I guess just past experiences, knowing that there are 20,000 people behind you and 11 girls on the pitch and all the support staff welling you on, that's always going to keep you calm. Never had anything like this, thank you very much, on crowd support. It was amazing, it was an incredible experience and thank you everyone for coming today. Sarah Taylor. Quite a comeback. Bit of a fight in there. It's been a roller coaster year for most of the team. I got back to training to see how it goes after my break. Tammy Beaumont. After the first three games, I had to be reminded that I have been doing well over the last one year. So many of the girls stood up and it has been a real team performance right through the tournament. Lauren got us off to a pretty good start but we didn't quite do ourselves any favors with the middle order collapse. The bowlers, Shrub Soul and Brunt, then stepped up. In my head defending the total was never in doubt. But credit to the way the Indians batted. We came to Lords in April, a lot of hard work went into our preparations and it is a great moment. England coach Mark Robinson. India played really well. It's always about getting that one wicket, and then you get two and three. Slower bowlers were always going to be hard to get away. This team has a lot of heart and courage. Incredibly mapped by ICC. This tournament.